everyone, I'm here today with the ferrets. Now, if you've watched videos in the past on my channel, Sweetie Pea's Pet Shop, um, then you would have seen their cage, but we have some exciting news. We recently bought them a double high cage, so their old cage was the size of what you can see in the camera now. We are going to put the ferrets in their pen, and then I'll show you kind of the whole view of what's going on. Oh, there goes the little mess up on the rail. So there is the second half of their cage. <laughs> we decided to put all their cuddly stuff on the top half and just keep the bottom half really basic just with their food in their litter box because they do tend to make a mess with the food and the litter because Pippin is a digger. So we're hoping that having this new double level will help to keep all of their hammocks and kind of cozy items nice and clean for a longer period of time. <laughs> They're very excited. Look at them. <laughs> Now the ferrets do get about three to five hours a day out of their cage. They have a whole big room to run around in and play with toys and things. Um, but even with that, we felt like their cage was just a bit too cramped. So now that they have this double high cage, I feel a lot better about um, leaving them in the cage, especially um, when my boyfriend and I go away on vacation. Uh, we have a trailer up north, so now that it's summer, we would like to be able to go up there a lot more, um, but I just really don't feel comfortable leaving them alone for such a long period of time. We do have family members and friends that come and take care of our small pets, but at the same time, you know, they don't have enough time in their schedule to sit and watch them for like three or five hours each day. I'm really pleased that we got this cage so that we can leave them in there when we go away and they have enough room to exercise.